Oh, we're off. This is the Terramax. It's a 10-ton six-wheel drive military truck. There's nobody in here but me, and I'm not driving. Yeah, it's driving itself. And it really is. It's not remote controlled. It's not some glorified form of sat-nav. And there's no hidden driver. Which begs the question, how can it see where it's going? In fact, it's using whiskers. All right, if it's got whiskers, where are they? But these are a very special sort of whisker, because they're invisible. In fact, they're lasers. Up on the roof, that spinning cylinder houses 64 of them, each one revolving 15 times a second. And that equates to it managing to gather every second 1.3 million touches on the landscape. And this is what that looks like. Each tiny dot on the screen shows a point a laser whisker has touched. Build those up over a couple of seconds Terramax gets an astonishingly accurate map of its surroundings. The idea is that a convoy of these supply trucks could drive behind enemy lines without putting servicemen at risk. But what would happen if they came upon something unexpected? Something like this. 12 concrete-filled bollards. It should be terrifying, but it kind of isn't. It's kind of joyous. This thing has a personality. It's as close to alive as I can imagine a truck being. So how good are these things going to get? When will it end? When will we reach a point when somebody will say to you, what, you're not driving yourself? I mean, why would you do that? It's dangerous and irresponsible. This is the future. This little truck with its array of whiskers that work in exactly the same way that a Harper Seal's whiskers do, it's just these are lasers, is the future. This is what, this is what we'll all be in. It's brilliant.